Hi, I'm Vic and welcome to Geek Eye Farm, where we do things differently. And some things I've been doing differently a long time. 37 years ago, Saz and I were married in St Cuthbert's Church in Hoddesdon, near London. And um, I've loved every year of it. Anyway, I thought, well, let's do something sloppy and romantic. So we're going to do a geeky thing with my wedding ring. The one true ring. Well, not quite like that. Anyway, one thing people want to uh, do is to find out whether something is actually like gold. Um, so I'm going to do a little thing on the bench here, show you how to measure the density of something that's an odd shape. Unlike that Archimedes chap, uh, we're not going to jump into a bath with it and see how much water overflows. No, we're going to make use of buoyancy. Yes, ships uh, float in water because they displace a certain amount of water uh, that pushes the boat up. We're going to use the same thing but in reverse. The weight of the ring is going to push the water down and we're going to weigh it. Don't worry too much about how it works. But let's just say that we can weigh the water that the ring displaces. That gives us the volume, then we'll put the ring in the water, weigh it again, gives us uh, two numbers which we can divide one into the other and get density. Lowering away. So we can get it in the middle there. Swings around a bit, but the water will damp that down. Now it mustn't touch the sides, it mustn't touch the bottom. And that's going to be completely submerged though. There we are. So we're not on the bottom. And it's swinging freely in the water, and that is weighing 0.7 grams. And that means it's displacing 0.7 cc's of water. So now we know the volume. Now, to get the density, we put the ring in the water. Alright. So now it weighs 10.6 grams. The results are going to vary a bit depending on exactly what uh, they've alloyed the gold with. Let's trot on over to the old computer and we'll do uh, 10.6 divided by 0.7 and we get 15.14, um, which is about right. You'd expect 18 karat gold to be about 15.4. Pure gold is 19.32, and the cheap crap they sell as 9 karat gold would be somewhere in the region of 11. Anyway, I'd like to thank Suz for putting up with me for the last 40 odd years. Um, and also uh, my mate Roland Perry for shooting the wedding video. But for now, that's your lot, down on Kiko Farm.